So how do you think Kobe would look at the Lakers right now? In disgust. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm glad you brought that up. Um, so <laughs> <laughs> the Lakers right now are a franchise that it's like Sleepy Hollow with no direction. Your head's off and you don't know where you're going. Oh, you know, Sleepy Hollow, he, his head would be off, but he knew it. exactly where he was going. The Lakers with Jeannie Buss, and we spoke about this, uh, what I like to call pregame, but during the meeting, I spoke about how you know there shouldn't be any limitations on women. And I want to preface that by saying, I'm not putting it on women, I'm putting it on Jeannie Buss to say, she needs to reevaluate herself in the job that she's doing. Um, you, first of all, you mm. should not hire a coach without a, a president of your basketball operations. Um, that's number one. I think that's dumb. Uh, secondly, when I look at and assess what Magic Johnson did, you traded away D'Angelo Russell. Now, of course, a lot of things was going on in L.A. at the time because of the Swaggy P yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I think when that was a personal and a business decision was not made. Um, Obviously not. Julius Randle and Brooke Lopez walked. Julius Randle was a, a 20 and 10, 20 and 9 guy this year. Brooke Lopez all of a sudden is like the fifth splash brother, brother, and he's hitting threes and he's balling for Milwaukee. Both of those guys should have came back and could have came back. You decided not to do that. You created so much in February and late July with that Anthony Davis trade oh my that God. Um, we already knew it. People who really follow the game, you can tell when confidence is not on the floor or just a lack of wanting to play with somebody. You ever play with somebody that shoot too much and then whenever you get the ball, you say to yourself, I'm not going to pass you the ball? That's well, yeah. Yeah, you, can that, you, can you can see it. You can see it. You can see when somebody just, I don't want to play with that person. And uh, we knew it. Uh, Contavious Caldwell Pope came Same out. Yeah. He ended up saying it like, yeah, the yeah, trade yeah. really messed us up. And you can tell. Uh, I just think they have done a terrible, terrible job with managing the Lakers, considering who the Lakers are. The Lakers are not Detroit. The Lakers are not uh, Atlanta. You are the Lakers. Mm -hmm.